So I traveled to Mexico in October and the first city we went to there was Guadalajara. And uh, from Guadalajara, uh, oh, an hour and a half away, there's a town called Tequila where we decided to take a day trip. And so this town, as the name says, is famous for tequila. It's one of the cities, uh, towns in Yellowsco um, state that uh, makes tequila. On the way to tequila, uh, you see fields uh, of agave, which is the fruit that is used to make tequila. And so you see a lot of agave plantation on the way to tequila. So we decided to take these local tours and these local carts, um, which also includes the city tour and also the tequila factory tours. Uh, so these tours are about uh, 250 pesos per head. We bargained a lot. Bargaining is a key. And they took us around the city um, and eventually taking us to uh, the tequila factory. Was the market? Okay. Now it's a bar, it's a restaurant. Okay. And what do you call market in Spanish? Mer mercado? Mercado. Mercado. Oh, do you speak Spanish? No? Jose Cuervo, hmm. salsa, and orange. The most famous factory is Tequila from here. These are the factories, and we're going to Orende. Yes, Orende. Leaders of tequila every day? Every day. This is ever. And it's called Casa Salsa. Casa Salsa. And this is the area. Over there they have the barrels. This is the second oldest factory from here. Second oldest? Yes, 1840. Super. And what is it called? Exacelda el Martinio. Exacelda and Martinio. Martinio. Let's go and see. Okay. And inside they have the old machines. Okay. The steam is for the, the agave. Oh, the agave, okay. The uh, are from London, 1910. Then the ovens rock. I can inside. smell the... The pineapple. The pineapple. It smells so sweet here. Okay, so we're going to be trying... This is the first reposado. First reposado. And all these are made here or something else? This is a mar like amarero. This is okay. licor. It's tequila with uh, flavor. Okay. I gonna. Okay, let's do it. With the first reposado. Oh, you have. <laughs> she's taking them all. <laughs> Wait. Cheers yeah, to Mexico. Tequila and tequila. So we were taught how to uh, drink tequila the right way. You breathe in, then you take the tequila in your mouth, you put it and leave it in there for three seconds, then you swallow, and then you breathe out. And the hit that it gives you is amazing. Okay. With tequila. But with tequila. Oh. Get some more. And how do we drink this? Yeah. To the fifth tequila taste taste, which doesn't Salute. feel like a taste. <laughs> Salute. We're doing a coffee flavor, which I think is going to be my favorite, because coffee. Salute. Did you get anything too, or what? Mmm. Salute. Salute. So our next stop was the very famous Orindale factory. Now you get tequila by, from Orindale all over, I think all over the world. But um, it was an experience at the factory because we saw how those pineapples or agave, um, as they call them there, are converted into um, tequila. And so we went through the whole factory tour with the help of our um, guide. She told us how um, all the equipments are used to um, produce tequila. So basically those are the pineapples, uh, which is the part of agave that is processed to uh, uh, make tequila now again because they look like pineapples is why they're called pineapples and um, 
our um, guide there she told us that it's very itchy if you touch them and I by mistake touched it and it was wasn't the most comfortable feeling so now these uh, pineapples are sent to those rooms uh, the processing units one two and three where they're boiled and then uh, there were three processes which I've forgotten how uh, they're made and then they're made there and uh, the, then the final product is uh, tequila say that again it's the best tequila it's not a normal tequila. It's not a normal tequila. <laughs> it's like an extraordinary. It's the best tequila. we can get in the world. <laughs> well, <laughs> yes. Salute. Now, put it, put it in your mouth because this is the right way to drink it. Put it in your mouth, swish it around, breathe in, swallow it, and breathe out. Okay? Perfect. <laughs> So we sat there on this, at the city center, sipped the tequilas and watched some street art, which was beautiful and was amazed the kind of talent the locals have. Um, local street art is always fun. And then we also got some churros and so this guy this guy is very famous in tequila we asked the locals where to get the best churros and he was making some humongous um, churros and so we ate those and I think I've never been more satisfied for the remaining part of the day we did some shopping at the local stores and walked around the town it's a really really old town but it's beautiful it's colorful I wish I could have uh, gotten more videos I was busy enjoying um, the site so I couldn't get a lot of videos but I would definitely want to tell everybody to come to tequila once in their life <laughs>